Hi there. Hi, I'm Olusha here. Oh, Labi. Welcome to our YouTube channel, Lightboat TV, where you'll be watching edifying, comforting, and exalting content. As you watch, please, please, like, comment, subscribe, and share. And don't forget to press the notification bell so that you could be notified when a life changing content is dropping. Thank you so much. God bless you. Life Boat TV committed to the preaching of Life Boat Jesus through visual. Mr. Joe, your admirer. <laughs> that was serious brother back then. And what about him? I said I will go when I'm done. Because I can't afford to stain you with my sin of not being intimate with God. So you can go. Oh. There, it has not gotten to that. I was only trying to explain certain things to you. I do not mean to hurt you. I'm not a happy man. My wife has become something else. Honestly, I am fed up. Each time I try to talk to her, she misunderstood me. It's nagging all the time. Anger everywhere. In fact, it's so bad that sometimes I find it difficult to sleep. There you go again. I'm talking about visiting a friend. You are talking about a relationship. How does that correlate? Ah, you complained about everything. I think I deserve an explanation to your whereabouts this morning. Where have you been? Why are you treating me like this? And we are married. Please. Honestly, since we had come back together, I couldn't take my thoughts from you. 
Um, good evening, good evening. Evening? <laughs> Sorry. Pardon my manners. Afternoon. Good to see you. What, what's happening here? <laughs> um, actually, I saw your wife and she said she was traveling. And I was like, why would she be traveling? on a day like this, I mean Sunday, you know, <laughs> and uh, uh, at least Sundays are special days we serve the Lord, especially we. <clears throat> Actually, um, Sunday is not the only day we should set aside in serving God. Our personal relationship with God matters most. <laughs> that's, that, that's the point. That's the point. Um, I've, I've convinced her and... Um, anyways, she's, she's no more traveling. Abby? Yes, yes, yes. I will not be traveling again. Okay, uh, but, but I don't think I've seen this face before. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Um, actually, we attend the same church. I joined sometimes ago and um, also a customer to sister Kike oh I see it's all right thank you thank you I guess that must be Mr. Joe. <laughs> you are funny. Yes. But I will call him back. I will call him back. Kike, you better stop this thing before he stops you. What is it now? <laughs> Mr. Joe is just a friend. and harmless friend for that matter. Is there any offense in that? I really pity you. A married woman and a semi-married man. Eh? You are just toying with fire. I mean, you are just keeping fire in your bosom. Hmm. See, you have to remove this thing before it starts to burn you. Come off it. Get me? Come off it. What fire are you talking about? I told you this man is just a friend. And I don't think there is any offense in that. Hey. Friend. Friend or boyfriend. Kike. See, you have to quench this fire from its source. God has blessed you with a loving and wonderful husband. Please. Do not throw him away with your own hands. Eh? See, this fire has to be quenched. And it has to be first disconnected from its source that fuels it. See, I'm your intimate friend. And I can't allow or watch you to crumble these beautiful homes that the Lord has built for you. Wait, though. What are you even insinuating? Do you think there is something between myself and Mr. Joe? Come off it, friend. It shouldn't be you. I'm not saying you are having an affair with him, but... What is but? What is but, Kemi? Are you saying I'm unfaithful to my husband? No. No. I'm talking about that husband. I, I told you, I don't even know what is going on these days. But that apart, 
I don't have anything to do with Mr. Joe. We are just friends. That's it. Listen to me, Kike. If God sees you, let men also see you. Don't you think this carelessness of yours can lead you to an unexpected corner? What could crop up of these advances between both of you is unpredictable. Kike, of our confidence precedes great fall. Don't you think about the aftermath of this, your fasting closeness with this man? You are married for God's sake. And this man may have another intention that you don't know about. Don't you think of it? You are right. But the scripture says that wisdom is profitable to direct. I know God will teach me what to do. He will teach me. Thanks so much. Kike, the Lord will not teach you what you already know. All you have to do is just to detach yourself from this man and that you can do by yourself. And you know this man very well. And I'm not sure he had a change of heart. And if this man has not been circumcised by the Lord, Kike, what I'm sensing may come like a flood. <sighs> Actually, we are not here to please another. We are here to make an inquiry. Okay. A few days ago, we were here. We booked a birthday surprise. But due to an unforeseen situation, we were unable to be here. And we want to know if you people can refund our money. I don't. That may sound absurd to you. Anyways, did you drop the picture of the celebrant? Yes, yes. Please. Ah, but well, wait though. This woman was there with a the man on that day. Yes, they? she was there with a the man that day, sir. Ah. That's not possible. Myself and my friend planned the surprise birthday. She wasn't aware. She wasn't aware at all. So it's not possible she, she came. Of course. Yeah. Sir, she was there with a the man that day. Ah, a man? How could she? I'm confused. Who is that man? Ah, who is the man? Actually, with the look of things, I think the man must be her husband. Because if you see the way they are doing on that day, like, haha, <laughs> love is really sweet. I see. So, sir, you have spent your fund. But if I may ask, who are you to the woman in question, sir? Excuse me. Good day, sir. What? I can't believe this. So amazing. Charles, I can't believe this. What was the meaning of this? Charles, does that mean that my wife is cheating on me? I know, Jamie. Don't go to the S3. It's not up to that. Although, I'm confused also. Because, because I have shown her enough love and I doubt she will have any reason to do that. About if eventually that Kike is cheating on me, it's going to be bad. I don't know how I'm going to cope with that. I love her. I love my wife. And I've always given her everything. Ha, <sighs> Christian sister, Kike Lomo is used to be a fervent and vibrant sister. How, how could she be doing this? Yet, we have to take it easy. We have to take it easy. We have to be slow in taking decision over this matter. Okay? I, I, I can't be slow in any decision making for now. I, I, the best I can do is this. Because those girls, those ladies, what they said, they were just sure of it. 
Yeah. They saw a man, simple. Yeah. The man was all over her. I will get to the root of this matter. It is war. Well. It is war. Well. It is war. Well. I'm okay. Ah. What is that? I said your food is ready. Please, let's go and eat, Cho. I am okay. Wait, oh. What, what, what did I hear? Did you just call me Ife? Ife? I believe you are not talking to me. Because the last time I checked, I have become a non entity to you. So it's not possible, it's not possible I become your affair just like that. Senseless woman. How could you even call me that? What have I done to deserve such a name? Ha! Huh. You don't deserve it. You have, you have, you have acquired it. Ha! Huh. No wonder you enrolled our children in the boarding house. As your husband in this house, I find it very difficult to even touch you. And I never knew that you have been enjoying yourself everywhere, anywhere. Anyways, I am not surprised. Since your love for God has dropped grossly, how will you not then commit adultery? Hold it. Why are you saying all this? Is it because of the man you saw me with this morning? How could you even think about that? It's not a thought or a fact. Okay, tell me, where were you yesterday? I was with a friend. Correct. That's the truth. You were with a friend, a mad friend. And both of you went into the restaurant. It was all over you. Ah, ah. Christian sister. Ha! Ah, I don't even know that you have deteriorated to this extent. And if I mean, it's not what you think. Oh. oh. You insisted on traveling this money, and as your husband, I gave you instruction to stay back. You said, no, you must go. <sighs> and someone from nowhere. Possibly a man that you cherish so much. Ha! Huh. Just advise you to come back home and you came back. By the way, is that man? At least you were together in the car for over 20 minutes. Uh, um, although. That settles it. That explains it all. You see, the truth is, Jeez. I can no longer. Huh. Live with an adulterous woman in this house. Ah, Jesus. After all, the Bible says that you can divorce your wife ha. on the basis of an adultery. Ha. Also, you have said at times without number that you are fed up of me, that you don't have feelings for me, and I cannot continue to beg you to do that. Therefore, I am done with you. Sweetheart, please. No, no, don't complain. Ah. Don't complain. Sweetheart, please. I am done with you. Please. Ah, Jesus. Ah. Jesus. If I may, please. Ah. Jesus. What have I done to myself? How did I even arrive here? Ah. Lord have mercy on me. Your, your husband doesn't deserve you. Just. He told you again. I asked you to live my life. Do you think I'm joking? Joe, live my life and leave my home. I don't want to set my eyes on you again. Leave now. I'm not actually after your home, but you. Don't you know I still love you? And I still want you to be mine forever. So, you are deliberate about your closeness with me all this while. Ah, 
I'm indeed a fool. Ah, why didn't I notice all this? When did I even arrive here? Joseph, so you actually worked on my feeling and my stupidity. But now I know better. Please live my life. It's too late. Jesus! Ah, ah, Joseph, please. Going to lie down ah. now and allow me to do what I want to do dead daily. Jesus. Because I'm going to show the world that Christian sisters are easy. Ah, yeah, I'm in trouble. You see, the, the, the industry now ah. scam. Jesus. <laughs> in fact, the, the church. Yes. It's fake. Jesus. I only do that to arouse your feelings. Uh, I planned it to trip. But I was unable to get it. You only escaped because I arose your feelings. This could have happened in the hotel where we will lodge. All planned. <laughs> Minister Jojo! Okay. Ah, ah, ah. hey, Jojo! See, I told you, these Christian sisters, you know, they uh, they can be deceived. I told you now, huh? I don't know any feelings. They are not different from others. Yeah. Yeah. Mr. Joe, Mr. Joe! <laughs> you and this your adventure, you can say that again. You see? Yeah. FM. The Lord has anointed me. To chase after Christian sisters, mm -hmm. FM, and it's for fun. Honestly, <laughs> honestly, I'm really enjoying it. <laughs> it's so sweet. They are so sweet. <laughs> Funny enough, their husband have not eat much of them. Uh, uh, anyway, anyway, um, uh, you talk about anointing. Who anointed you? Is it the same Jesus Christ that I know that you are talking about? <laughs> anyway, that aside, um, what about that um, woman? That lady that escaped your trap while on campus during our university days. Well, la la! That's the only That's me, that's me, that's me, Kike. Actually, she escaped them. But now, FM, <laughs> I've re strategized. Ah, ah. FM, I've got to tell the man. Hey, I'm not going to tell the man. I'm fully equipped onto all good works now. Equipped <laughs> indeed. Ah, ah. Anyway. Um, which strategy are you trying to use on that lady now? Hey, me, Joe. Uh -huh. ah, you just wait and watch. I told you I've joined their church two Sundays ago. Wow. And she bought all the lies. Oh, Monty, most of the money. Hey. Can, can, no? uh, uh, I'm not born again, and uh, my family is in Ghana. Ghana, <laughs> indeed. Uh, that reminds me. What about your wife? Yeah, go, go, are you go, go. hearing from her? Wife. Forget about that one, daddy. Wife, Kenny. See, I'm on a mission. I'm on a mission. I'm an, and I must fulfill the mission. There eh? you go. Don't worry. I'm going to update you. Don't worry. Don't worry. Yeah. Please, please, please. Don't ruin my life. Ah. Honestly, I don't know why my wife is doing this. I'm really. Bro Yomi, what is the matter? Your wife called me a few minutes ago. You mean my wife called you? Yes. So she could call. What is mm. Excuse me, bro. What is it? 
Okay. Let me try to say something here. Sir. Okay. My wife is having extramarital affairs. God forbid. Mommy, it's already happening. When did you discover that? I actually have been suspecting her for some time now. But today, I caught her at the wrist. Jesus, I can't believe this. Never. Where? Bro, Yomi, there's need to go to your house right now. I am not going anywhere. I've left that house and I won't go back there. Please. Yeah, I'm sorry. Eh? Can the devil be entreated? I only work on your feelings with my hair, gift, and fake love. Ha! Huh? Okay. I was unable to get you voluntarily. And I will force you for voluntarily. Ha! Huh? We should not give devil chance to rule over your house. I said I am not going into the house. I have left that house. I'm no longer interested in her than I go. Bro, you me? I will sort You should not give devil chance to rule over your house. I believe your wife will be waiting for us now. If she's waiting, let her wait. Let her wait till eternity. I am not going anywhere. I'll find my way. I will find my way. I'm fine. I'm not going anywhere. Bro, you me? Please, bro, you me. There's need to go to your house to settle some things. Please, we are appealing to you. <sighs> we need to again. We are not friends again. Ah, ah, no. No. I would rather die than to face this shameful heart. Kill me. <laughs> Where will you land now if you end your life? <laughs> you, you have unconfessed sin. If you don't know, Kike, you better get down now. And if you want me to waste your life, so be it. I'm sorry. <laughs> Please, Lord, forgive my carelessness and my foolishness, Lord. Lord have mercy on me. <laughs> you are wasting my time. As you lie down for death. No. Jesus. <laughs> what is this? Don't move. <laughs> 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 Is this not Joseph? Don't call me brother Joseph, I am Mr. Joe! Ah. Ah. They walk in the garden They look like children of God But the nature is not of the nature of God what is all this about? They go extra wide to achieve. That was the goal. same man I saw my wife with. This Their weapon is of the ah. Thank God. Thank God. Thank God. Give if you didn't meet me, I am sure that this woman brought her love into this house to kill me. This is not even a question of um, of faithfulness. But this is a question of life and death. She wants to kill me. Pastor, please, let me ask this woman what my offense is. That she wants to kill me. Daddy, it wasn't like that. I was fooled. Please, help me to beg my husband to forgive me. Uh. How do you mean? Can you shed light on this? Because I'm greatly confused. Actually, I... Hey! 
That is, whether she talks or not, I am less concerned. Can you imagine? Could you believe that yesterday I planned a surprise package for my wife? And this woman left the house in the morning and did not come back until very late in the night. Jesus. She actually said she was going to her friend's house. But she didn't go there eventually. She went into the restaurant with another man. Till now, she has not confessed who that man is. Ask her if I'm telling lies. Ask her. Never. How do you know this, bro, you me? Please don't give devil more chance in this house. Daddy, you think I'm telling lies against my wife? Myself and Charles, my friend, were in the restaurant this afternoon to get a refund of the money we paid for, for a surprise package for her. Because, of, of course, the money did not fulfill the purpose for which it was paid. And when we got there, what we heard nearly destroyed our eardrum because they told us that she came that she came with a man that they even accept in the place as a husband because the man was all over her all over her in fact the the the, the, the most embarrassing thing is, is that a waiter oh my God. from the restaurant was asking if I am a member of a family. Can you just... Sir, the truth is, I'm fed up. I'm fed up. I don't want to see her again. No. Something must be wrong somewhere. Sister Kike, please, as a father in the law, tell me the truth. Because I know you to be a vibrant Christian. When were you captured? That I don't know. Daddy. Mommy. <laughs> Although I'm guilty of all this offense, in fact, I'm worthy of crucifixion. <sighs> Truly, I was with a man, but it hasn't gone beyond friendship. Friendship? Okay. Who was the man you were with yesterday? Ah. <laughs> ah, Daddy, it was, it was, it was brought yourself. That's it. Jesus. Can you see? I've said it all. Sir, let her go. I've lost interest in her. Please. Don't. Come near, Please. don't come near me. Please. Don't step back. <sighs> step back. Yesterday, I was pleading with you to stay with me in this house. And you left. You went and stayed with that man. Can you imagine? Please, bro, you me. Don't conclude in that way. After all, you still acknowledge her as your wife. Please forgive her. Forgive. Yes. Forgive my fault. Please, 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 forgive please, please. Oh, oh, Savior. Jesus Savior. <laughs> 
Oda eh eje ma yin wa nkan eje ma yin wa nkan eje ma yin wa nkan to ba mo won jade nu apo so ma si win to ba na won jade won fo ni ibe lori ni it's not up to that now eh pala pala o pala o tun fe ibo you solve that you solve that eyin eyin wa da eh bembe oh agiri bi yin mi mi e wo e wo kun dada ebole <laughs> Ah, ah. <laughs> hey, Timori, no. Say why? Oda mi loju ipe, oda yon lo koni. O se bi lo koni. Ah, ah. Ipori, wana timbo, hibo no timbo. Mi ishe o ni ishe ibi. Agiri ibi. Ile, eh, 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 edu, Ile, shu mi sodo re mi. Tongbe ni, oke mbe nye. Kede ma wo, aro re mi nye ni ko ya. Mo de eran lo wamo gbe lo se ospitu. Ah, koda mi nche wa go mi ma pe ojo ti lo bayi mi o de dagbere nle tele fun ya wo atawon mo mi pe mi o ni sunle tori awon mo mi ati yawo mi mo se lo le e ma binu e ma binu oda agbo arakunrin eh oda o ye to ti lo bo ngan o ma ni le mo mo so rese o ko ko oya so rese bo arakunrin mo ti yin ni lojina ko pada wali pada wali pada wali in tan be lowo re ke se nkan ti o le fun lati se kan mo wa de odo re ri ohun ko si pe jade o si jade si wa ko ni lo to lo dodo odo ohun lo ti mo o ba tan o ba tan eh o da eh sa e mo yin eh o da eje eje n gboko mi da ni ro ro o le gbe oko ko pa pa woni so kun ri na am fine love for ko mo wa de ore i odo ile ore re mo si am fine yi lo you have really hurt your husband. Honey, what are we going to do now? Huh? The Lord will teach us. But please, call Gandhi. We will sleep here tonight. And I know there will be put to shame in this family. Amen. Hello, Gandhi. Daddy said we are sleeping over at Briar or me, a church member. We are sleeping in his house tonight. Please, lock the gate and take care of the house. God bless you. Good night. Sister Kike, are you sure you had no intimacy with this man? Oh, Daddy, please believe me. Although he tried some move when we were in his car, that was when I realized there is fire on the mountain. I don't even know that I have gone a little bit from my master. <laughs> Adi, please, help me to find a solution to this problem. Please. <laughs> <Jeez>. <laughs> your room? No, sir. But that is where I've been sleeping for some time now. It means you have not been sleeping with your husband? <laughs> Sister Kike? <sighs> Jesus. Jesus. <laughs> Sister Kike? Bro, you're me. Bro, you're me. 
It's only me. Please open this door. That is the place we are going. Ileti and Oni. Say all the allergic people are alone. Oh, she's allergic. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Lord have mercy. Are you expecting anyone? No, ma. Oh, it sounds like the vigilantes group around here. Mm -hmm. Yes. Are you sure? Yes, ma. Maybe they are here for my husband's support. Then go and call him. Ah, oh, oh, me. Okay, <laughs> I understand. Honey? Yes? We had a sand at the gate. And Sister Kike said it must be the vigilante group. Please, help me tell Brian me so that he can attend to them. They are wolves in the garden. They look like children of God. But the nature is not of the nature of God. They go extra mile to achieve their goal. Their weapon is of the kind of ba <laughs> Don't be lost in the woods. If that's the one, but I thought of you. You know, what you want be. I've been talking. Go sing or two, shame you. Moa, okay. Moa, dada. Eh, 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 Jesus is Lord. 
bro Joseph. Sorry, Mr. Joseph. So, you are a wolf in a sheep clothes. <laughs> Yeah, I'm right here. I'm in charge now. In charge where? You, this foul spirit, inside this body, I command you to come out in the name of Jesus. I will stay here. I will complete my assignment in life. I succeeded in the life of Joshua, the son of God, and the Israelites. Is she greater than Joshua? I will complete my assignment here. Ah! Use your power and go in the name of Jesus. Lord, for exposing this man after all. Draw your me. Please find it in your heart to forgive your wife. She has she has learned her lesson and she is now helpless. Please. Forgiver. Jesus says in Matthew 6, verse 14, If you forgive others their wrongs, your Heavenly Father will forgive you your wrongs too. Also, in that same verse 15, it says, If you don't forgive others, your Heavenly Father will not forgive you your wrongs too. Please, brother, forgive her. Follow me, please. Mommy, I love my wife. And she knows how much I love her. But she broke my heart. She shattered my heart. Just imagine that. That man broke her heart. Hmm. He could have been sending the video or the picture all over the world. Hmm. My, my, my wife was too careless, so gullible, that she could not discern the Gibeon around her. And because of her spiritual tiredness, Bro, you're me. It is well. Please let us have a seat. Please. <laughs> 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 Give glory to God. Thank you for everything. The devil has already lost this battle. Babe. Thanks so much for your love and support. We are so grateful. Bless the name of the Lord. Let us pray. Check on them. Yes, I am. 
but I insisted that they must take breakfast before leaving this morning. That's good. So That's very good. Um, yeah. The principal of our children called on Saturday that um, we need to visit them in the school. <sighs> hope everything is okay. I hope so. And so, I really want us to go on time today. Oh, do you have any appointments? Ah, appointments can. Okay. Any appointments can wait till further notice. My family confessed in everything. Thank God. Thank God for this. If I me, I was even thinking that maybe we should withdraw them from the boarding school. That's good. Is that your final decision or we still deliberate about this? There's nothing to deliberate on again. I have decided. I want to give them time. If I need to forfeit anything, I am ready to do that. Just to take care of them. Hmm. Yeah, that's good. Thank God for this encounter. Okay, I'm in full support. We are doing this together. Thank you. Mm. Thanks so much. So, let's go back to our hotel. Thanks to God. Sir, we have decided to withdraw our children from the boarding house. Why? Is boarding house no good for God's children? No, Daddy. The children were not formerly in the boarding house. It was their mother that insisted that they should go there later. Okay. Yes, Ma, you are correct. Daddy, these children are in their delicate stage, the teen age, where they really need proper home training and to learn godly living, of which some hostels are lacking, although some are really doing their best. And to the best of my knowledge, but the house is a separate home where children are being raised and trained for parents that are busy and are used to travel home. So, by God's grace, I have decided to limit my movement, especially traveling, so as to have time for my children. Because I believe that is my ministry, and that is where God wants me to be fruitful. Wow. Wow, fantastic. I appreciate your presentation and I salute your courage. Thank you, sir. This is where many parents miss it. As a woman, your first ministry is your home. So you don't leave your children to grow by chance or luck. I'm really impressed. From